noticed that we could make a difference for people. Like when they come by, they leave in a better mood. And a lot of people have told us that we made their day. Nice. <laughs> a customer came up to me and said it was the best fish they'd ever had. Something happened to me, and I realized I was making people happy. Give me a big hug. This gave me a plus in my life, and I love serving the people now. Excuse me, Ty. Sorry, made you look. The fish philosophy is about engaging people and creating positive change in their workplaces and home lives. Too much coffee! Too much coffee! <laughs> you know, are you being, this is a lousy stinking job, or are we being, well, we're just selling fish, or are you being, you know, world famous? Play pieces! Play pieces. You know, you're going to do something differently when you're being world famous than you are if you're being impatient. The fish philosophy embodies an entire way of life. It's been translated into 14 languages, and it's created positive change in thousands of small businesses, classrooms, Fortune 500 companies, and homes around the world. You don't have to throw fish. You just have to have the energy. You have to have the commitment. You have to have fun. You have to have fun at work. Like most people who visit the Pike Place Fish Market for the first time, I was drawn in by the excitement, the fun, the creativity, the playfulness of the fishmongers. But the longer I spent at the market, the more I saw the playfulness didn't just come from their actions, say like throwing the fish, it came from the spirit of the people working there. That teacher knows that this is the place to come to where they can turn that feeling around. Sure, I could stay home and eat bonbons, but I'd be by myself. And I'm going to go to work and be with people who I like me. It's about communication. It's about, it's about being there. Conversation is essential. I think that's how we make sense of our world.